Yo, what's up guys? I'm back again with another video. And our guy this time is on another cologne oil. And this is Creed Ventus. What's so you guys see this Creed Ventus? Yeah, I've been hearing a lot of hype about this one. So I wanna check it out. I'm gonna freshen up with it a little bit. Get you guys my take on what it smells out in the light. Rub a little bit on my hands, dude. Okay, sit that there. That's for one ounce of Creed Aventus. Okay. Now, what I gotta do, get my take on what it smells like. Okay. To me, it smells, uh, I get. Like a pineapple lemony type smell off the top. Now this was released back in, from what I read up back in 2010. So this it's been around about seven years now. Uh, I've been hearing a lot of people push the hype about it, but I never really oh got into to this one. But it's saying the main accords is fruity, sweet, leather. Smoky and woody. Okay. Now that's off the top. The main accords. Now his version success inspired by a dramatic life war peace romance lived by the baller is whatever. That's the baller design. Okay. The top notes is uh black, concurrent, or something like that, bergamot. Apple and pineapple. The heart is rose, dry birch, jasmine, and protruly. The base is oak moss, musk, and vanilla. Okay. Now all that being said with the notes that's in here and this, that, and the third. Uh what it actually smell like to me. Now the oils could be different. No smelling in the cologne oil here, guys. It might be a little bit different from the actual cologne. But the way this right here is smelling, to me it smells more like, reminds me a lot of uh, Izumiyaki. With the, I get the lemons, like a lemon pineapple. You get a lot of leather. It's a leathery smell, too, in this. Uh... You get the pineapples a lot. It's dry down your skin about five or ten minutes. You get a lot of the pineapples. Then you get a lot of the leathers coming through. Cause those are the main accords anyway. In this one. It's fruity. I guess the, the apple that's in this and the pineapple was giving it that fruity smell. For some reason though, it's got a lemony. It's like a lemony type smell in here too. So now I get a little black hints of lemons. Uh, that could be just the pineapple and the apples, but it's giving me like a lemony type smell also. But it smells good, but it's so much other stuff out there that smell similar to it. Uh, a little bit, you know, I'll tell you guys what it's kind of remind me of a little bit. It smells a little bit like Aquadijo, I guess that's the, the pineapple lemony type smell. Now I can get another blast of this. Let's put it on. Let's put a little dash on like that. Put it right here. Okay. Now let's put this rub this on just like this here. No, like that. Um. Then just fan it out. I'm gonna give it a second to dry down. I'm gonna smell it again. So it's like a strong blast of lemony type smell. Now I know it's pineapples and apples that's in here, but somewhere it's kind of making me. It's got a lemony type smell also. I guess that might be the bergamot that's in here. 
It reminds me a lot of uh, Izzy Miyake, though. Izzy Miyake and um, Aqua D. Joe. For some reason, I guess that's a lemony like, type smell, but it's probably, it's not lemons, though. It's probably more or less, it's the pineapple and the apples. I guess the fruitiness of it. No, because the top note is fruitiness. So, with those two being combined, it reminds me of kind of like a Aqua D. Joe. It's got a lemony type smell, too. That's what it smells like. But uh, I would say Aqua D.J. might smell a little bit better, you know. That could be just my opinion, you know, <laughs> of it. But, uh, yeah, guys, it's, it's um, really nothing special about the smell, you know. I smell better, you know. Okay. No biggie deal about the smell. I smell better colognes out there. For real, for real. And, um... It smells good, but you know a lot of people are pushing the hype about it and uh, this, that, and the third. You know, it smelled this way, it smelled that way. Creed events is here, Creed events is there. Like it, you know, it was smelled so good. You know, it's way people was acting about the way the scent was. So you know, but it reminded me a lot of Aqua D. Joe and Izzy Miyake. I'm telling you. Now, I could be off now. Like I said, guys, this is in the oils. You know what I'm saying? In the oils. Now, the, the smell of the cologne might be different. You know, might be a little twist to the cologne compared to the oil. You know? But I got it in the oils, so I'm telling you what the oil smell like. You know, the oil smell, it reminds me a lot of Izumiyaki and Aqua Dijon. Sure do. That's what it reminds me of. I know other ones out there that remind you guys of this one. Got that leather, fruity, lemony, pineapple, appley type of scent to it. And so, like somewhere, I get some lemons, then I get the woods. I get the woods, and if you smell good, you get the woods in the very back. Back as it dries down, it get more of the woods come to play, you know. But off the top, when you're smelling this, you get more of a like a lemon, then it, you know, you get the, like a lemon, pineapple, apple fruity, uh, it's like a whizzy, a uh, leathery smell. You got a lot of leather, a lot of leather in this one too. It smells like a lot. It's something else I smell, smell similar to it too. It's kind of sweet like too. It's got like a sweet smell to it. But uh, yeah, it smells good. But it ain't nothing that I would go crazy over. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I don't see why a whole lot of hype was pushed about this one. Because it's a lot of them out there that smell this good, you know. Uh, Chris and Dora, Salvage. That's more of my style. I like Jakar Nori, the original 80s version. You know, I'm a Jakar type of guy. I like that, you know, that rugged, tough type smell, man. Me person, this one all right, but I'm I'm more of a Jakar fan myself. That's that's kind of type of scent I like. All right, but uh, yeah, guy, I hope you enjoy Creed Adventures. Um, reminds me a lot of Aqua Dijo and Izzy Miyake, the original Izzy Miyake and the original Aqua Dijo. That's what it smells similar to in my world. I could be off now, like I said, that cologne spray might be different, you know. But smelling here, smell like Aqua D. Joe and his Miyake. All right, so like I said, guys, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Share my videos with your family and friends. And uh, yeah, guys, stay smelling good for the ladies. And I hope you enjoy it, man. Uh, I always bring you guys a little something, something. And uh, take care, man. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace.